this FAU Owls offense. McCam in the tailback, he takes it in for the touchdown, and just like that, two plays into the ball game, FAU gets six. Sling Kiffin's offense working to a T. For Davidson. Speaking of, how about a touchdown for Davidson? Pay dirt after the big gain in FAU, at least offensively, making it look easy, overcoming a little adversity after that penalty on this drive. This Charlotte 49er defense as we take another look, and he just walks. There's nobody there. Three wide receivers to the left for Reynolds. Reynolds looking to the end zone. Touchdown, Charlotte. Victor Tucker on the score. Let's take another look. Chris Reynolds had a guy in the flat, but he said, no, I want the guy in the slot. Victor Tucker goes in and hauls in a nice over-the-shoulder pass to put Charlotte on the board. Has to shake the tackler. Touchdown, Charlotte. Quick pass. My goodness, Jacob Hunt, the backup tight end, gets the score. And now... On the 17-yard line. Trying to get on the board once again before halftime. Going to the end zone. FAU, does he hold on? Indeed, he does. Touchdown, Mr. Harrison. Tavares Harrison just doing it and doing it well on this drive. Reynolds to the left. McAllister in the end zone. Touchdown, Charlotte. Flag down in the backfield, however. That's in, that's in a holding zone. Hold the celebration, 49er fans. Second down, keeping it on the ground. In for the touchdown is Malcolm Davidson. And Malcolm Davidson, just like the first touchdown off the left side, why not? Two Charlotte defenders there, obviously. To the air. It's rain diving in for the touchdown. FAU in the end zone once again. And Charles in for the FAU touchdown. Give him six. FAU just rolling it up here, making it look easy. Starting a season with blowout losses to Ohio State and UCF. This is going to be three wins in a row as Charlotte gets the touchdown courtesy of Ishad Finger. Making the score look a little bit more respectable with 13 seconds to go.